What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Pick Plug back again with another video, and today we're gonna be hopping into Sunday, February fourth. Picks for today. Now, yesterday we did have a pretty bad um, record in the YouTube picks. We did miss all the picks, and that is because uh, the Tobias Harris was actually ruled for out. Um, he was injured and he didn't play, but Prize Picks at the time did have his, his lines up. But if we did know from the jump that Tobias Harris was out, our lines would have definitely been different. Tyrese Maxey, we definitely would have gone on the over for because that game would have ended up being a blowout like it was. Um, it was end up being a blowout and he did actually get subbed out and he did not get as many minutes as was projected. And Tobias Harris, of course, as you guys know, he was he did not play because he was injured. So that prop would have been there and some of the other props would have been there considering that uh, that was just a um, big factor that was not projected um, as soon as he did get injured. We did make the necessary adjustments in the discord so if you guys do have access to the discord you guys were able to get the newer uh, picks of the day and we did end up going three for three on these picks of the day we had clint capella going over 10 rebounds nicholas claxton he went and had 15 rebounds so this was a very easy prop to go for and cam thomas uh we did hit this uh these this prop um yesterday so we had that in the the youtube 22.5 points and that did hit as well now this one was a very easy prop as well for the points plus rebounds plus assist considering that it was a blowout and they basically had no one to guard cram thomas so this was a very easy prop to go for and if you guys were in the discord you were able to cash out very easily on that prop so if you guys do want to go ahead and join the discord for the most updates if this does ever happen again where one of the players uh does get injured in my uh slip you guys do want to be in the discord for all the updates on these slips so that you guys can get the most access and as well as the premium discord there were the two pick parlays the free picks that you guys did have access to so if you guys want to join the free discord as well you guys are able to do that and get some free extra pricks so that you guys can uh, maximize uh, fully um, on these picks but without further ado let's hop into these picks for today now again, as I do say in all my videos, you guys do want the most value out of all these picks. So you guys do want to make sure that you are subscribed with the post notification button on. And if you guys do want me to keep on posting these early props and picks, do please like the video and comment down below which props that you guys are gonna be going for yourself. And uh, some that you may have not uh, heard in the video that you guys are gonna be going for yourself without the help of this video. I do enjoy all of your input in these videos and it does help me keep on making these videos with all your guys support so please uh, go ahead and like and subscribe and comment if you guys do enjoy this video so for our first pick we'll actually be going with a pick from the Detroit versus Orlando game this game is projected to be a very close game considering these are both two teams that are pretty evenly matched and this should be very solid minutes from both ends of the starting teams so both of the starting players should have a very fair amount of minutes so we'll be going to over to the assist tab and we'll be going to France Wagner, uh, 4.5 assists. This will most likely be pump, bumped up to four uh, to five assists. And if you guys do have it at 4.5 assists, I do believe this is a very, very solid line to go for. Um, considering he has hit this line four out of the last five games. The last game against Minnesota Timberwolves, who has a very solid defense. He did end up having five assists. And against the Sacramento, uh, the San Antonio Spurs, he did have five assists as well. Uh, against Dallas, he had six assists. So he is consistently going over this line. And against the Detroit Pistons, this is a very, very solid matchup for him to go over, considering that their defense isn't that great. Looking over here on Outlier, which again, you guys can use for yourself using the link in the description below. You guys can sign up for a seven day free trial. And as well as using any of my promo codes in this video, you guys can get a free month of bronze VIP in, in my Discord server. So you guys can go ahead and try that out for yourself. But looking here on Outlier, we can see that in the last 10 games, he's hit this line six out of 10 times. And looking at his matchup against the Detroit Pistons, overall, they are 17th in assists allowed. And against the small four position, which is what Franz Wagner is, uh, they are 23rd in assists allowed. So they are ranked very high in the assists uh, in the ladder when it comes to assists allowed per team. Uh, they allow plenty of assists. And as long as he does, if he, around, he averages around 30 minutes and as long as he does gets around 30 minutes or more, he should be able to easily go over this line considering that uh, he get, he went against teams that um, had 27 minutes against Miami 
and he did go over this line. So uh, against uh, Miami's defense, he should easily be able to go over against the Pistons defense, um, considering that this does not have, uh, this has little to no blowout potential. They are evenly matched in offense and defense, um, and there should be plenty and plenty of game time for France Wagner. Looking here over on ggfantasy.com, which you guys can actually get for yourself, clicking the link in the description below, you guys can use code TROPHY for 25% off. We can see that his line is actually at 54%, and DG Fantasy does actually have him at 142, and other sports books have him at 149 at the highest, which is actually, or 150 at the highest, which is actually great to see, considering that the bookies are actually favoring him to go on the over. Sorry, it was actually messed up with another player, but looking at the DG Fantasy's uh, mark for him to go on the over, he's actually favored at 132, and other sports books do have him around 130 range as well at the highest of 140. So this is a great prop to go for if you guys are looking to go on the over for France Wagner. He is very projected high to go on the over on across all sports books um, for this prop. This prop. So again, if you guys do want to know all the odds for every single prop that you guys do make, do go ahead and click that link in the description below and use code TROPHY for 25% off your first month. Hopping into our next prop, we'll be going to the points tab. And I am actually very filling this uh, prop right here with Bojan Bogdanovic. He has hit this line um, three out of the last five games. In the last game he against the Clippers, he actually did hand up uh 26 points which is a very good defensive team against the orlando magic he should have a very easy time going over this prop of 17.5 points and this should just overall be a very tight game which will cause him to get a lot of minutes and he should easily be over this property now in the last 10 games we can see that he's gone over this prop seven out of ten times and he did end up having a couple games where he did have around 30 points and 26 points so that's good to see he is consistently going on the over and he's only gone on the under um twice or, or three times and the two times that he two of those three times he was actually very very close in some blowout games or this this okc one was a blowout and the cleveland one wasn't a blowout but it was very close he only needed one more point to go on the over and i do believe this is a very very solid matchup to go on the over uh, against the detroit pistons so uh, or against the Orlando Magic. So we can see that he averages around 31 minutes. And in his last game, he only had 29 minutes and he was able to go on the over uh, having 26 points. Now, if you guys do wanna go for other props like his points plus rebounds plus assist, that is also a pretty solid one, uh, but his margin has actually been a little bit less. I do believe that he overall has a very good solid game against the Orlando Magic. Um, he Last game, he did end up having uh, 30 uh, points plus rebounds plus assists, but he only had three assists and one rebound. So for the safer bet, I would go for the points tab. Um, and he has gone over this prop seven out of 10 times. Our next prop will actually be a chalkboard prop. Now you guys have been loving the chalkboard prop as of recently. And these props are actually have been winning pretty consistently and getting us some decent money. Again, if you guys don't know what chalkboard is, it is a app that you can alternate these lines. So if, for example, this France Wagner, 19.5 points, if you feel that he's going to hit this and he's going to uh, blow past it uh, extremely high, you think he's going to get like 25 points, you can actually raise his line to, let's say, 22.5 and get a higher payout. So that's what we're going to be going for today. Again, if you guys do want to try out Chalkboard for yourself, click that link in the description below and use code TROPHY for 100% deposit match. Now, we are going to be going with a player that we just spoke about, Bojan Bogdanovic, and we'll actually be bumping his line normally his line is at 17.5 but we'll be bumping his line up to 23.5 and getting a three almost four times payout on that so if you guys do want to have a piece of that payout let yesterday we'd have, have a flash sale on Trey Young. you only needed one assist and you guys got a extra um basically a free prop to go for it now they do honestly have more often uh flash sales than prize picks does um, Price Picks does uh, some like Taco Tuesday sales, but they do uh, sales that are basically like you only need one of the stats to actually go on the over, which is absolutely insane. You guys can have a piece of that and just click the link down in the description below and use code TROPHY uh, to try it out for yourself. But we'll be going for Bojan Bogdanovic and we'll be bumping it up to 23.5 and having a higher insane payout. For our final prop for today, we'll be going over to the assist tab. 
and we'll be going for Cade Cunningham 6.5 assists and I do believe that this is a prop that may be bumped um, later on in the day and we'll be going for the over he has hit this line uh, three out of the last five times and in his last game he did end up having 11 assists against the Clippers and seven assists against the Cleveland Cavaliers and 12 against the worst defense in the league uh, was the Washington Wizards and the Orlando Magic aren't too far off from their Washington Wizards defense so we could see more of the similar amount of assists from the Orlando Magic. Looking here on Allower, we can see that he has actually gone on the over for this uh, prop. We can see that in the last 10 games, he has gone on the over seven out of 10 times, but we are looking here on Orlando's assist. They are actually third in the uh, league for allowed assist, but all we can see that is he only needs around 30 minutes to actually go on the over for this prop. Normally against Boston, they are actually a very solid defensive team. He did end up having nine assists and against uh the tr uh, toronto he did he averages around 10 to 12 assists um honestly is very he's honestly very solid in the last 10 games he's gone on the over seven out of ten times and we do see him uh going on the over for this game as well um consistently in the last 20 games he's gone on the over 65 percent um head to head he's gone over the over um 10 uh he's gone on the over one out of two times but the last game that he didn't go on the over, it was a blowout um, and he did end up having six assists. He only needed one more to go on the over. So I do believe that he should easily be going on the over for this prop. Seven assists isn't too much for him. He has gone on the over in the last three games and in the last five in the last five games, he's gone over a three out of five times. So that is it for today. Again, do uh, if you guys like any of these picks. Let me know which ones that you guys are tailing. Let me know which picks that you guys are going to be going for yourselves. And like and subscribe this video. I do appreciate all the support. Um, if you guys want me to keep on posting these early props and picks, do hit that like button. And if you guys do want a bonus pr uh, pick in tomorrow's video, get this video to 500 likes and I will give you guys a bonus slip, a bonus prop for tomorrow's video. Again, if you guys want the full six pick parlay, Go ahead and join that link in the description below join the discord and you guys can get the full six pick parlay but thank you guys for watching and i will catch you guys in the next one peace